Hey, welcome to State of Tech. My name's Jared and today is Mail Day and we're opening a fun package that I got from Amazon. Uh, you, sometimes I go on Amazon and eBay and click around and find fun things and here we are with yet another one. So what I have here in this package that came directly from China is uh, neodymium magnets. And I ordered a slightly larger uh, pack than, than what was by default because I know of many uses that I have for these. I've got kids at home and just showing them the power of magnets is really fun. Uh, I kind of um, sat down and my kids and I were playing with some of their magnetic toys and I was showing them and explaining to them how magnets work and all that stuff. And it was just a fun lesson to have with my kids, uh, you know, teaching them how magnets work. And uh, then that led to going on to YouTube and watching videos about magnets and whatnot. And it was just a really fun learning moment that I had with my kids. Um, now, these magnets are some of the strongest. Uh, these are really small magnets, uh, but they're, <laughs> look how they come packaged in a uh, tin foil wrapping, it's awesome. Uh, but typically you could find these magnets in, in different amounts from 10 of them on up to hundreds. And uh, they're just extremely small kind of coin. They almost look like coin, like little coin batteries. Uh, magnets and they're just really strong like pulling them apart from each other is even really hard and they're just extremely strong magnets you could see I didn't even have them close and they just it grabs it I mean these are really powerful um, really pa powerful magnets for the size now the uses for these magnets, I mean, there are many uses that you would have around. Uh, I know on our refrigerator at home, I've got young kids and we have their little projects and stuff that are up on the fridge and the typical magnets that you get, um, even the decorative ones just don't hold stuff up on the fridge. These magnets will hold stuff up on the fridge. I'm not even worried about that. So that's gonna be one use of these magnets. Um, the other use is just gonna be to play with them and uh, my kids and just try to do little experiments and stuff. Um, <laughs> that was awesome. Check that out. It just drags it from, even this is just fun. I mean, it's fun. It's something to nerd out on. Um, but being able to spend some time with my kids and just play with these magnets is gonna be great. I have seen some uh, people review these magnets and talk about the coating uh, kind of being not that good and it kind of comes and flakes off. I could already see that on one of the magnets. The more that you bang these magnets together, I mean, I just had a little piece of it shoot off and hit me. So the more you bang these magnets together, the more they're gonna, um, they're gonna fall apart. I mean, the coating over the top just isn't strong enough to take a beating and the magnets are gonna start to disintegrate. You could even see now um, around the edges, that's, it's more than just the coating on the outer edge of the magnet. It's actually chipping away um, as I, you know, beat the magnet up a little bit. But that's not technically how you're supposed to use up oh, there. I just had one break in half. So, you know, when you spend less than $10 on a fat stack of magnets, and that included shipping, by the way, um, they're probably not going to last. I mean, that's why the quality uh, is so cheap. I mean, that's why they're so cheap. And of course, they're um, inexpensive in quality, but nonetheless, they're still fun. Uh, I could see using one of these magnets. You can make decorative stuff for your refrigerator out of these magnets. Um, you know, just don't expect them to last forever because they are cheap magnets that, that came from, from China and they do make higher quality magnets. Um, this is just an inexpensive and even the little chunks of the magnet are still magnetic and I can, that's just, that's just fun stuff. I mean, to a little kid, to a, a six-year-old and my four-year-old and my two-year-old, like this stuff is just gonna blow their mind. Even little magnetic chunks, just making it dance around, using the magnetic field to um, to just drag things around. I mean, even, even one of these magnets mashed up into little pieces is gonna be a fun experience with my kids. So check out the links in the description below uh, to where you can find these. They're extremely inexpensive. They're a fantastic little um, science experiment with your kid. I've also linked up two other videos down below that I highly recommend you check out on magnets. That's um, definitely fun, something for you to educate yourself with 
And of course, if you have kids, you're definitely gonna wanna check out those videos and watch them with your kids because magnets are just one of those things that are mind-blowing to children. And even as an adult, here I am, age 36, playing with magnets. It's never too late for you. So if you like this video here on State of Tech, make sure to like it and subscribe to our channel uh, where we you know, play with technology all the time, more specifically mobile tech. But today was a fun uh, kind of you know, move away from that into magnets. So uh, check out the links in the description below. If you have any questions or comments, leave those down below as well. And we hope to see you here next time on State of Tech.